Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Welcome back if you have been here before and if you're new then it's lovely to have you here. Thank you very much for joining me. Today as you can see I'm just outside my castle in Transylvania and I'm bringing you a sort of, well it's a bit of an inadvertent haul. Um, I I was never that super keen on Killstar because the first experiences I had with them were not very good. And then I got a couple of more things and they were fine. And then a few weeks ago, they had a massive 30% sale. And what happened was I had gone with Mr. Jane on a lovely holiday to London and I'd saved up some spending money for when we went. But I didn't really buy very much there wasn't very much that I wanted where we were and so when I came home I thought you know what I think I'll buy myself some leggings from Killstar because I really wanted some new leggings I'm trying to get away from plain ones and this whole sort of Marie Kondo only have what brings you joy thing is really starting to take hold here at Wilkes Towers and I thought, well, plain black leggings don't really actually bring me that much joy. So I saw in the sale they had these. And these, I'll put the names of them and everything on the screen. And I will obviously insert um, pictures of me wearing them. But they are, as you can see rather spectacular and this is the first thing that I got well that I put in my basket as it were and it's a big skull with a big sword coming up from the bottom and it's a horned skull and a snake and some other little skulls at the bottom and it's actually got a print on the other side as well which I really like that goes all the way down there like that and um, yeah so I decided to get these I got them in a medium because you know the label says on the back if cats could talk they wouldn't <laughs> which is I think quite funny and um, basically it's cotton and elastine elastane elastine mainly cotton and a few percent elastine so nice and strong i've worn them a couple of times um just out and about you may have seen if you follow me on instagram you'll have seen me the other saturday standing in the sunshine wearing them at the beach um and i think they're rather lovely and as you can see me walking up and down in them a medium is not a bad size for me. I said to my friend yesterday, um, you know, if you do have to go up a size, it is not actually the end of the world. Okay, it's annoying and you might think, mm, why? But then it's not going to, you know, hurt anybody but you that you're going up a size. So anywho... The next thing I thought was, well, I'll just have a look at the sale and see what else they've got. Because how can you not, really? And I got a top and it says on the label, don't believe everything you think, which I find rather wonderful. And it's a sort of... It's got sleeves and it's got straps and it's got a slight amount of distressing. So it's like this with straps and then it's got sleeves coming out like this. And it's got like a little bit of distressing at the front here. And it's got one at the back. I mean, I always said, and I think it's got one at the bottom as well. I always said, oh yes, it has on the back. Like that. And I always said, why would you pay money for things that have had holes put in them when you can 
you know wear things and make holes in them yourself but I think it's quite nice actually and it's one of those prints that's quite dark and difficult to see so there it is there it's sort of a bunch of skulls and some trees and various things and then on the back there's another skull it says one I, lo I think it says one mistake at a time no one one thing one something at a time anyway on the front and on the back it says fear um, but it's really comfortable and again I got it in a medium because if you wear a small it'll just in the summertime it will be too squishy and you'll get all hot and sweaty and none of us like that in the summertime so I was browsing away browsing away and I thought well in the spirit of um, only having things in the wardrobe that you know really make you want to wear them and um, don't make you think well it's all right I'll, you know I don't want to think that when I see my clothes by the time I get to my age I've got under half my life left so I want to wear things that make me think oh yes I'm really pleased I've got that I'm really looking forward to wearing it so I got a couple of skirts um, again in a medium um, this label says giving an F asterisk asterisk K doesn't really go with my outfit which is an old one that we've seen before and on the front of the actual skirt it says life's too short to be afraid and that is very true so this particular um, skirt it's really stretchy it's like a stretchy pencil skirt and it's got a big skull there it is and because it's this lovely um, let me tell you what the material is it's 82% nylon and 18% elastane so because it's that it's not it's not um, it's sort of satiny so when you walk it doesn't ride up your legs like those little cotton skirts do if they're too tight I did get it in a medium again as I say and um, it's very nice I like it very much it's plain on the back but it's this fantastic skull on the front and I just don't think I've seen anyone wearing anything like it actually there we go and I got a second one because the same material same sort of idea mid-length pencil skirt but this one has got um, all sorts of conjuring and magical symbols on it so it's got a circle there which has got um, different it's like um oh it's sort of like a conjuring circle I think because it's got the points of the compass it's got um, different Hebrew letters around the edge and at the top it's got a triangle with premium art on um, hail to the first and last of everything in Greek um, of course um, there it is oh yeah you can see it. if I get it in the light there look there you can see it I'll hold up the conjuring circle as well in the light yeah again plain on the back but um, it just feels nice and with a good bit of um, supportive underwear it's going to look nice as well it's got a sun and a moon it's got some pentagrams yeah I love it I love it very much indeed so that's the second skirt 
And then the last thing I got, um, I've still got it on the hanger so that you can see it, is a little dress, a little skater dress. And what happens is, you'll see it in the try-on anyway, the straps make um, a five-pointed star. And it's the same idea. It's got all sorts of lovely palmistry. It's got, let's see if I can hold it up to the light and show you. This is the back. Can you see that? Yeah, there we go, look. That's the back. It's this sort of print that's really, really difficult to see unless the light hits it or unless you're right up close to it. Um, I'll turn it round and you can see the other side. There, magic in all its forms. There's suns, there's eyes, there's all sorts of sigils, there's conjurings, there are, what else are there? Um, tetragrams, all sorts of different grams, moons, stars, in fact, I can't see anything that's not on here. There we go. Um, as you can see from the try-on, it is... Um, a tiny bit sort of of a revealing nature shall we say but um, you could wear a little shrug over it or a little bolero or a bolero even <laughs> bolero is a dance I think um, yeah a little bolero or even wear some one of these things that you buy that fills in the gap but I don't know and this um, it's not the same satiny nylon-y material as the skirts this is wait while I find the label there's quite a lot of material here actually and here we go oh this is 95% rayon and 5% elastane as I say not as satiny and silky and nice to slide against as the skirts but I think in the summertime it's going to be light enough to wear it's very very pretty the print is beyond lovely and I think it's going to look pretty nice so all those things added up together I think came to something in the region of 60 pounds in the sale which for one, two, three, four, five things from Killstar, I think is pretty phenomenal because they do charge an absolute arm and a leg for things, as you know. Um, but I think I did quite well getting some bargains, and I won't be buying. I won't. I will not be buying any more for quite a long time. In fact, I have um, only today unsubscribed from their emails where they keep sending you things going, look at this, you need it. And I go, no, I do not. So, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Do please give it a big thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. If you haven't subscribed already, what have you been doing with your life? Just press that red button now. Thank you to everybody who has bought me a Kofi on my Kofi account so far. It's really kind of you and anyone else out there who has enjoyed my videos without advertisements popping up to annoy you. I haven't monetized this channel because I think having adverts is very annoying and I just, if you want to say thank you for that, then you can buy me a hot drink. Um, do please take care of yourselves. Southern Hemisphere, autumn coming on, getting a little bit colder for you. Northern Hemisphere, spring coming on, we've got some bluebells coming out in the woods near us. And that is one of the most beautiful sights that you can ever see, is an English woodland full carpeted with the deep purple blue 
of English bluebells. It's just one of the sights that makes my heart skip a beat, I have to say. Um, but then that's just me. Yes, take care of yourselves. Do please be kind to all your animals, any animals you come across as you go through your daily life. Don't forget, stay strange everybody and I will see you next time. Bye for now.